Hello and welcome to It's Tomorrow News. I am Dipasha Sharma. Federal forecasters expect a La Lina climate pattern to form in the coming months for the US. Federal forecasters expect a La Lina climate pattern to form in the coming months, according to a report released Thursday, offering a potential picture of what the weather could look like across the US this winter. The annual winter outlook report for the National Oceanic and Atmospheric Administration's Climate Prediction Center details that a La Lina event has a 60% chance of emerging by the end of November. La Lina is characterized by cooler than normal ocean temperatures in the Pacific, which typically leads to drier and warmer conditions in the southern tire and cooler wetter weather in the northern tire to the continental US. This year's La Lina is expected to be weaker and shorter in duration than once in previous years, making it somewhat difficult to forecast months in advance. Federal forecasters do know so far that large waves of the south and east coast are favored to see warmer than average temperatures this winter. According to NOAA, this is especially true for Texas and states along the Gulf Coast like Alabama, Florida, Louisiana and Mississippi. Meanwhile, the odds of cooler than normal conditions are higher for the Pacific Northwest to the Northern High Plains. That includes states of Washington, Oregon, Idaho, Montana, North Dakota, South Dakota, Western Minnesota and Northern Wyoming. There is also a chance that the Pacific Northwest and parts of Montana and Wyoming will see better than average conditions in the coming months. Areas in the Great Lake regions are also at risk of better than average conditions, with these probabilities being the strongest in portions of Ohio, Indiana and Kentucky. Further south, there is likelihood that states bordering the Gulf of Mexico, as well as Texas and southern New Mexico, will experience drier than average conditions this winter. NOA also anticipates widespread moderate to extreme drought to persist across the majority of the Great Plains and portions of the Rocky Mountains. Drought is also likely to develop or worsen across the southwest and Gulf Coast. Meanwhile, the center said drought conditions are expected to improve or even possibly end in the parts of Ohio River Valley, Great Lakes region and portions of the northwestern US in Washington, Oregon and Idaho. That's all for now. For more weather news updates, stay tuned with us on It's Tomorrow News. For more global weather updates like this, subscribe to our channel and hit the bell icon for regular updates.